Yo, what up, fam? It's your man, VRG, Vegan Rap God, a.k.a. Soy King, a.k.a. Vanilla Gorilla. Rawr, vegan Power. What? You see the title? Boom. We got the Zalman Sashimi. We got the No Tuna Sashimi. These things, bruh. These things, <laughs> yo. I never tried no vegan... I, I only vegan fish I tried is it Forky's these fish fillets super dope um some vegan tuna I tried really good I got that here uh but something like this I never really tried and I never was a fan of even before going vegan I never had sushi or like raw fish because this is sashimi right it's supposed to kind of be eaten raw I guess with sushi or whatever um so I don't know it's frozen now I'm gonna thaw it out Probably try a little bit of it raw, but I was mainly thinking of just cooking it up a bit. Um, then with some basmati rice, some spinach, you know what I mean? Got some tartar sauce, probably put a little wasabi, mix it up, make some tartar wasabi sauce. You know? Ah, yay. So yeah, yo, and this stuff is mad funny. Like, of course, it's super processed. <laughs> Chill. It's all good. Um, the, the nutritional content is wild. 58 calories on a hundred grams, of course, 0.2 grams of protein, 0.6 grams of fat, 13 grams of carbs, one gram of salt. So it's basically just carbs, but Hey, palm oil free, GMO free. What does it say there? All oh, plants, everything. I like that. So anyway, let me get to it. I'll get back with y'all in a sec. Don't mind me, you know? See some good light and just got to get a quick flex in. <laughs> you know how we do it. Yo, so here it is. All right. There's the tuna. There's the salmon. Slight difference in color. Can't. I guess you can see it a little bit. Um, the smell. Absolutely no kind of fishy smell to it or anything. Right. So these are still raw. What? Yo. Don't play with me. Don't play with me, all right? Give you carnage a taste of your own medicine. Slice you up real nice. Grill, eat, make some sashimi out. Carnage sashimi. Yo, oh my God. How could you? I'm just playing, yo. It's just jokes. All right. I don't know about this. This is weird. Okay, here's the tuna. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it just tastes like a little salty piece of something, kind of rubber. Same. I mean, to be honest, I ain't really, uh, <laughs> Definitely like that. I'm not crazy about it, but we, 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 we finna grill it up. You know what I'm saying? Toss it in there with the, I got the vegan tartar. I already got my spinach chopped up. I already got my basmati rice cooked up. So maybe once I mix it all up like that, you know what I'm saying? Maybe it'll be, maybe it'll pop off a little bit better. Cause like this. Uh-uh. <laughs> All right, I'm going to get to it. Yo, this was an epic failure. I mean, it just got worse. I warmed it up. It just got worse. <laughs> now it's soggy and, like, some of it is, like, melted. And I tried a little piece. I'll try it, I'll try it again just so y'all don't think I'm BSing, like, The texture is 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 bogus. <laughs> I am not no. Mm -mm. And I'm and I'm one of the least you can ask anybody. I am one of the least picky eaters you will ever find. It really something really has to be just not really good at all 
objectively for me to reject it. <laughs> I mean, everybody that knows me knows I'm just like, oh, no, I, I never say something's bad. I never complain. And I won't even say that this is bad. Like somebody might like it. I think I'm not doing it right. I think really you're supposed to just thin slice it and just put it in sushi with other stuff. I kind of wanted to have it like, you know, grilled salmon filet or or tuna filet. And that's definitely not what this is made for. So that was an epic failure. <laughs> so now I'm, I don't really even want to eat it. You know what I'm saying? I already got my, I got my spinach and rice whipped up. So I'm going to just go ahead and. Actually, I got two of these joints. Well, I don't need to show them both at the same time. So this is the tuna that I was talking about um, that I get here in the check. Garden Gourmet. It is fire. It is absolute fire. I got two of these joints. So I'm going to throw both of them in there with the rice and spinach. And like I said, I'm going to hit it with that vegan tartar sauce and some wasabi. Mix it up. Ooh, I already had the tuna. That's why I like. I didn't do a video about it because I just, one day I just got it and I, w I was hungry and I ate it. I like to do videos where it's like my first time trying it, but hey, it is what it is. I tried this sashimi stuff and it did not go how I would have hoped for it to go. But hey, that's life. You know what I'm saying? Just real. You can't win them all. You can in, in, in a deeper sense. You know, you win by learning. Now I know I will never buy that that vegan sashimi product again ever <laughs> ever so that's a win right there at least now i know so all right let me get to this tuna and i'll just show y'all a little bit once i whip it up and scarf it down here's a quick look at it all before i mix it all up you know what i'm saying y'all seen the rice and spinach then boom smack it with the tuna this, this tuna is so fire it's so legit the smell the texture the taste i love it i could eat it every day Especially like this with a b big old globs of tartar sauce and I love wasabi. Now, this is for two meals. I just, it's easier for me to just mix it all up in one and then I'll eat half of it and, you know, save the other half for later. So, voila, all mixed up. I added a little more wasabi and a splash of soy sauce. I forgot the soy sauce. Yo, what the you, what the you them say? Bussin'. Oh. Yo. <clears throat> this straight up. I wish we had this vegan tuna in Montenegro. I love it. I could eat it every day. And it's like, you know, protein, whatever. But something about him with the wasabi. Like, I, when I had tuna, I had vegan tuna, not sushi. When I had, first time I had sushi, it was vegan sushi, right? And the only thing I liked about it was the wasabi and soy sauce, right? So that's that's why I got to smack the wasabi on there, some soy sauce. I do like it with some tartar sauce or some mayo. But yeah, I mean, it's kind of like a sushi bowl, I guess, right? Kind of? Whatever it is, it's fire. Hmm. Nope. That's it. Subscribe, like. Let me know down below. Have you tried any kind of vegan sashimi? Did you like it? Because I didn't. I almost lost my appetite, honestly. Like, it wasn't the taste. The taste was just, was just salty. It was the texture that was just weirded me out. Um, but you know, that's on me. Like I saw it, I got it at Tesco and I seen it and I was like, I just got hyped. I thought it was just sushi, not sushi, excuse me. I thought it was just salmon filet and tuna filet, right? That you grill up. And I was like, word, I, I didn't even realize that it was sashimi and I didn't even know what sashimi was till I got home and I looked it up and I'm like, oh, oh, okay. So I, I like I said. If you like sushi and you like the sashimi sliced thinly and rolled up in the sushi, it's probably fire. Honestly, it probably is good. It's not meant to be eaten by itself. You know what I'm saying? Like, so I can't even hate on the product. It's not the product's fault. It's my fault. 
If you do like sushi, sashimi, if you see it at Tesco, cop it, try it. I'm sure it's good the the way it's intended to be eaten, but not like me. You know, I just want to just toss everything into a bowl and you know what I do. That. Come on, y'all want to watch me eat? Want I me mean? mukbang? Nah, weirdos, go eat your own food. You ain't ha you can't have mine. All right, y'all. Like I said, make sure you subscribe, like, comment if you want. And yeah, turn on post notifications. You see I'm back posting regularly. It's on and popping. A lot of content coming. You know, I'm be keeping it real always. Showing my, my, my workout, my diet, and just speaking on vegan things. You know what I mean? Let's go. Being a rap dog. I'm out. Peace. Come on, y'all.